mke mkubwa ya family ya Gashagwa ndugu yake na gavana na tulikuwa karibu sana wakati tuliunganisha chama cha jubilee alikuwa mtu aliamini ile mpango wewe ulipanga na leo niko hapa kwa niaba ya wajumbe constituency na wa Kenya na watu wa North Eastern kuleta rambi rambi zetu kwa familia na ndugu yake amenambia jana wewe na serikali umesimama na hawa ya mwisho mheshimiwa uh, rais au watu wa nyeri lazima kuchukua kura lazima wajipange kupiga kura na sisi kwa vile unajua rafiki yetu hako hapa leo mheshimiwa Raila sisi tuko tayari kwa uchaguzi wa tarehe nane wale ambaye hawako tayari watuambie hiyo tu mheshimiwa rais wa Kenya wafuasi wa Jubilee tarehe nane mwezi wa nane kwa mapenzi ya Mwenyezi Mungu sisi tutapiga kura na tunatarajia tutashinda na mheshimiwa huru kenya atakuwa kiongozi wa Santeni sana Asante sana. Asante sana mheshimiwa Dwale. Kama unasikia hiyo hiyo mgrumo ni kusema watu wamekubaliana na vile unasema. Eh, before I invite uh, the deputy speaker, I want to recognize all members of county assemblies here present. Members of county assemblies from wherever, please rise up wherever you are members of county assemblies and we have got a uh, makofi tafadhali um, uh, the speaker of the Nyeri county assembly was supposed to be speaking but he has yielded he's yield, he has yielded his two minutes to Mr. Osoi speaker for Kajiado because he is the chair of CAF so if uh, he will come and uh, just take two minutes to say mapole and then I invite um, I invite Mheshimiwa uh, Kembi Gitora, Deputy Speaker of the Senate, to speak on behalf of the Senate and also say and also introduce any senators here present. Bonasoi. Uh, Asante. Your Excellency the President, Your Excellency the First Lady, Your Excellency Deputy President, Your Excellency former President, uh, all protocol observed. On behalf of all county assemblies of the Republic of Kenya, we send our deepest uh, condolences to the family of the late Governor Gashagwa. We are representing uh, 47 assemblies here, and we came here to condole with you. And secondly, to give our last respects to the Governor. And listening to the speakers before me, is a clear testimony that devolution has made a difference in this country and we shall endeavor to build and work in accordance with the constitution. Lastly, as I yield the mic to the senator, the, this, the assemblies are mandated in the constitution to oversight the executive arms of government within the counties. This should never be misconstrued to mean personal differences. Whenever MCA or the county assembly uh, picks whatever is not going right, it should be left to be uh, related to work and nothing personal. May the Lord God bless you and comfort you all. Thank you. Thank you, Bwana Speaker. Um, your Excellency, in your absence, I had just said that uh, there is a tendency when you speak for it to rain. So I want to rush this thing before you speak and before it rains. So I would now like to invite um, uh, Honorable Kembi Gitora.
Your Excellency the President of the Republic of Kenya, Honorable Uhuru Kenyatta, Your Excellency the De <laughs> Your Excellency the First Lady Margaret Kenyatta, Your Excellency the Deputy President William Ruto, President Mwai Kibaki, our immediate former President. I met James Derito Gashagwa in 1972. He had come from Yahuru High School and I from Muranga High School and we met in Nyeri High School for our A-levels. And we did our A-levels together and like has been said in his eulogy, James was a brilliant student. When we did our A-levels and went to the university, he pursued, we pursued different courses but we managed to maintain friendships since that time. And for me, I've lost a very close friend. In, 19, in 2002, James Gashagua literally took me to the DP party offices on Gitanga Road in September of 2002 when I expressed interest to run for Kiharu constituency. He took me there through the registration and everything else is history. I've listened to the tributes being paid, particularly by his family, whom we have come to condole and to be with at this very difficult time. There are people I know. And I want to say this, that James Derito Gashagwa was a man of great resolve, and he mostly got what he wanted. But he did not do it for his own selfish ends. The fact that Nyeri County government was able to continue even when he was ill in London, in India and other places was because he had built an institution and his wish was to build a strong institution. When he went to Bomas in 2003, he stood very strongly for devolution. And that's the first time that James Derito Gashagwa told me, when you get a new constitution, I shall wish to be the first governor of Nyeri because I know I can help transform Nyeri. And I know he's worked very hard towards that goal in very difficult circumstances. We know the, how he dealt with the coffee cartels and that he did not quite succeed at the end is not an indictment on James Derito Gashagwa but on those people who fought an otherwise very noble cause. I believe that even if we were to say like Frank Sinatra that I did it my way and James Derito Gashagwa mostly did this with his way it was not for his own personal benefit but to benefit the people of Nyeri the people of this country and to transform a great nation may his soul rest in eternal peace and may, he, may perpetual light shine upon him before I sit down I know that there are a good number of senators who are here and I would like also to add that I'm here, first and foremost, to give my own message of condolences. And also to give the message of condolences of the Senate of the Republic of Kenya. And also in my own capacity as Senator from Ranga County, to bring the condolences of the people of the neighboring county of Moranga, which James also looked upon as his own in his endeavors to make us a better place to live in. If the senators who are here with us can please stand up. I think I saw a few. I can see Senator Moriuki Karoe, who is also a member of the family. Senator Daniel Karaba from Kirinyaga County. And Senator Michael Bubi Sonko of Nairobi County. <laughs> so thank you very much. And may God bless you. And may Gashagwa have eternal rest. Thank you. Thank you very much, um, Deputy Speaker uh, of the Senate. Uh, without further ado, I want to invite Governor Munya from Meru, who is also the Chairman of the Council of Governors, to speak and also uh, tell us the governors who are here. Thank you very much, Mutai. Take a very, very short time.
because I can see time is not on our side. We have come here to mourn one of our own, a fellow governor whom we spent time with for four years working together. I want to agree with those who have spoken before me that Dilitu Gachagua was a courageous man. He was courageous throughout his life. Even in his sickness, he was a very courageous man. I visited him in hospital. I visited him at home when he was healing. And I saw a man who was carrying the weight and the burden of sickness with a lot of courage, determination, and very high spirit. It's not a man who would indulge in self pity. The other very important attribute of the late governor of Nyeri was his commitment to devolution. He was the first chairman of the Agricultural Committee and he did everything he could to make sure that the reforms that were required to usher in the new era of devolved agriculture were done. Even when he was sick, he continued following to find out what is happening with agriculture, what is happening with the transformation of agriculture and the transfer of functions in agriculture. Even though not everything has been done in that regard, I think one way of remembering him is to continue improving on what has already been done. The other attribute I would give to His Excellency Nderitu Gachagua is his commitment to ordinary welfare of ordinary people, the ordinary farmers, and the war he really did to try and see the welfare of especially coffee farmers was improved. He was a very committed member of the Council of Governors who could give all his time to see that the county governments are functioning well and things are going the way they were supposed to go. We will greatly miss him. We ask God to bless him, bless his family, bless the people of Nyeri, and he did continue blessing Kenya. With those remarks, I would now want to take this opportunity to introduce the governors who have been able to attend uh, this uh, function. Due to time, they may not be able to uh, speak, but the fact that a record that the five governors have attended this funeral tells you the respect and the honor they had for their colleague, Deritu Gachagua. So I'll just mention your name and then you just stand up so that the congregation can uh, acknowledge you. So the governor of Machakos, Dr. Alfred Mutua, acknowledge him. The governor of Bomet, Isaac Ruto. The governor of Kiambu, Bwana Kabogo, acknowledge him. The governor of Guasinigishu, Bwana Mandago, acknowledge him. The governor of Erogeo Maraquet, Alex Torgos. The governor of Masabit, Ukuru Yatani, acknowledge him. The governor of Nandi, Dr. Cleopas Lagat. The Governor of Kirinyaga, His Honorable Davi, acknowledge him. The Governor of Siaya, Kano Rasanga. The Governor of Sambul, Luna Sukol, acknowledge him. The Governor of Narok. Bwana Tunai. Very well known governor, you know, from the Mara. The governor of Nyandarua, Waidaka. The governor of Nakuru, Bougua, His Excellency. 
the governor of Busia, Ojamong. We have even the deputy governor of Kiambu there, Kidinji, the governor of Taita, Taveta, who is also the, the vice chairman of the Council of Governors, Mr. Muru, uh, His Excellency Murutu, the governor of, of Mombasa, Hassan Joho, the governor of Kisi, I mean of uh, Kericho, Professor Chepuoni, the governor of Makweni, Professor Kibuba Kibwana, the governor of Baringo, His Excellency Cheboi, the governor of Kisi, His Excellency Ongoae, The governor of Kakamega, His Excellency Oparanya. The governor of Trukana, His Excellency Nanok. The deputy governor of uh, Muranga. The deputy governor of Kisi, who is also the chairman of uh, deputy governors. The governor of Nyamira, Nyangarama, the governor of Muranga, Mwangi Wairia, the governor of Viga, The governor of Kajiando, Dr. Nkendienye. And the governor of Nairobi, Dr. Evans Kidero. The governor of Ungoma, Ken Lusaka. The governor of Transoia. Dr. Kaemba, the governor of Kitui, Julius Malombe, the governor of Kilifi, Kingi, His Excellency Amazon Kingi, the governor of Varakanidi, His Excellency Ragwa, and his wife, the first lady of Varakanidi. Sorry, I could not say properly because of uh, distance. The deputy governor of uh, Embu. The deputy governor of Embu. She is called the DT, Her Excellency. The. Sorry for that mix up. Never intended. The governor of Kisumu City County. His Excellency. Ranguma, the governor, governor of Omambe, His Excellency Cyprian Awiti. That is the record attendance of governors in this funeral from. Of course, how can I forget our host, the second governor of. Nyeri County, Ambassador, Ambassador Wamadai, from the reaction, it is very clear that the Governor Wamadai, who is our newest member of the Council of Governors, will get the support he requires to be able to accomplish the work that was left by the Rito Gachagua so that this term and the legacy of Gachagua can continue and of course development can continue in this great county of Nyeri. Thank you very much and God bless you all.
Asante sana. Asante sana Governor Munya. But you forgot a very very important part of your responsibility.